Kish. Go ahead, Justin. Thank you, Sir Juan, for your time. How are you doing, man? Thank you, man. Uh, I'm good. How are you? Oh, man, just another day. I really appreciate you taking the time to do this interview. Now, next Friday at Bellator 161, you're taking on none other than Mr. Joe Warren. You know, how are your preparations going for this fight? Uh, the preparation has been great. I've been uh, living my camps up uh, in uh, Sweden and now here in the Mother Talk team. Now, like I said, you know, you're going into this fight against Joe Warren. You know, this is probably one of the biggest, you know, tests in your entire Bellator career. You know, this is your second fight. You know, what are some of the things that you saw in Joe Warren that you plan on pushing come fight night? Uh, I mean, he, he, he's a tough guy and his bread and butter is the wrestling and that's how he fights. I mean, he has one last knockout, I think, and one submission, but... The way he he's a decision guy, he, he grinds people out, and uh, yeah, I mean, I expect the best Joe Warren, uh, better Joe Warren than last time uh, when he fought, but I, I, I believe uh, I have more tools than him, and uh, my, my wrestling, my, my wrestling, is, you know, uh, it will, uh, my wrestling is better than his, I think, you know, with the way I set up my shots and takedowns. Now this is your second fight in your M in your Bellator career, actually, and this is the f first time that you're going to be part of the co-main event. You know, how excited are you to um, be be a part of a co-main event? Oh, I'm super excited. I mean, I I'm so happy that uh, I'm in the in the on, on the spotlight and uh, that uh, I'm fighting a guy like Joe Warren, such a big name, and uh, the co-main event. And I know I will. Uh, even uh, like uh, perform better just because of it. So, uh, you know, talking about your last fight against uh, um, Ty Mangello, uh, you you know you're coming off your debut fight. What do you think went wrong in that fight? And you know, how are you able to improve in this training camp? Um, I think my head was at the wrong place, and I just went through emotion in the training camp to to get that to that fight. I mean. I was training, but I didn't put my heart out like I had done for this fight. I've been really training really, really hard now, and I've been switching things up, and uh, uh, I feel really improved with my uh, with my striking coach uh, from Sweden Top Team, and uh, my all, all my coaches from the Top Team. They, they put a lot of time in me, make sure they they make sure I, I train hard, and I made, made the right uh, the might the right moves for this fight. So I feel I feel real confident, and I'm. Very, very motivated for this fight. Now, are you a fan of watching game film or, or, or fight film on your opponent? And if so, you know, what are some weaknesses you saw in Warren's game that you plan on pushing come fight night? Well, I mean, I saw a lot of, a, a lot of holes in this game. I mean, the, the, the way he defends himself, striking, the, the way he shoots in. Uh, and previous opponents he beat, the way he beat them, I think they did a couple of uh, wrong, they, they maybe, they, I think they had the skills to beat him, but I think they had the wrong game plan, the wrong strategy. And uh, after I, I know I will have the right strategy, the right game plan, and uh, I will execute a good performance at him, and I feel like I will shut down the game totally. Now, Sirwan, can you give us just a, a little bit of a taste on what to expect from you come fight night against Joe Warren? What's your game plan going into the fight? And I will pressure him. That I have great combinations, everything will be explosive, and I will look for the finish. All right, I got a couple more questions left. Thank you so much for your time. One of the biggest things right now is this Bellator bantamweight division. It's quite stacked. Eduardo Dantas just reclaimed the uh, the Bellator bantamweight championship. Where does a victory over Joe Warren put you in this division? Do you think it'll put you in line for a title shot next? I don't know if you put me against a title shot or, but I definitely believe he will put me on the like the contender list. That's what I believe because he's a two-time world champion and he's such a big, he's one of the biggest names in the organization. So 
it will catch up for my name to like to be on the contender list. Maybe one more fight or maybe I'll try to play away. I mean, I don't look, I don't look too much ahead. Right now, the only thing I have in my mind is that when I step against in, in the cage against your war. Lastly, Sirwan, what is your prediction for next Friday's fight against Joe Warren? A finish. Submission, knockout, doesn't really matter. I, I know I'll finish him. And, that, and, and a high paid fight. That's what I expect. All right, thank you, Sirwan, for your time. Good luck next week. It's going to be an excellent fight. Mr. Kakai taking on Mr. Joe Warren. Sirwan, thank you so much for your time. God bless. Thanks, man. I appreciate it. Bye-bye.